Pulmonary embolus, or a PE, is simply just a blood clot that occurs in the lungs. Now, a great majority of people that suffer blood clots will present um, with shortness of breath, maybe some racing heart, maybe a little bit of chest pain. They come into the hospital, they're evaluated, and usually put on blood thinners um, and, able to, and are able to be discharged in a very timely manner. A small group of patients, though, will go on to develop um, heart strain as a result of that. And that heart strain can come in different flavors. At the more severe side, we talk about people having massive PEs or PEs that cause uh, hemodynamic instability. It's a nice way of saying that your heart suffers the consequences of that blood clot and as a result of it can't do its job, which is provide blood pressure to the rest of your body. And so patients that present with massive PEs present with very low blood pressures. And so for us, it's a medical emergency. We have designed this multidisciplinary group where many doctors can come to the table with expertise in their field to help come up with a treatment plan that works for a patient um, in the short term when they come into the hospital and then also into the long term when they're dealing with the consequences of this disease over the next days, the weeks, the months, the years. Here at the University of Virginia, we have surgical interventions that can be offered where the clots are taken out um, by a cardiothoracic surgeon. Uh, we have uh, an ECMO system, which is essentially a life-sustaining system for the heart and lungs while the body uh, uh, treats itself. We have interventional radiologists that can offer clot-busting medicine directly at the site of the clot. And we have the facilities of our intensive care units that are able to uh, take care of the patients as they're going through this very important and very serious time of their life.